but it is Friday, so it is time to find out what to watch with local film critic Dale Pollock joining us live now with a look at three different shows. Good morning. Happy Friday, Dale. Same to you. Good morning, Audrey, Jackie, and Dylan. Great Good to morning. be with you. So let's talk about what we're binging right now. The Gentleman <laughs> on Netflix. What did you think? I think this is a very enjoyable series. I will caution that it is quite violent. Okay. So if the bloodthirsty nature of this uh, repels you, I would avoid it. But otherwise, I think it's immensely entertaining. It comes from Guy Ritchie, the British action director, who used to be married to Madonna. To Madonna and he is really a master at suspense and he gets terrific performances by two actors I was not that familiar with Theo James and Caius Scodelario. It's a complicated plot. It has to do with actually marijuana growing in English stately homes and how this whole crime ring is run. It's never dull, it's always moving. And I think over eight episodes, this is one of the most entertaining shows that's on right now, streaming series. And it, unless the violence bothers you, I found it very, very entertaining. So I highly recommend The Gentleman on Netflix, and I'm giving it four popcorns. Oh, four popcorns. Starting off strong, Dale. Okay. Right off the bat, Audrey, you said Dale, you're... my husband is watching it. You know, Matt watches everything. Everything that you, you recommend. <laughs> and um, every time I walk in the room, I, you know, I have no idea what he's watching half the time, the majority of the time. But I, I sat down for a little bit of The Gentleman just because of the acting was so captivating. Mm -hmm. wow. I mean, they are like top notch. Remind me the name of the man who's in White Lotus, the actor who we just showed. Theo James. Him, he and his, is so his, good. Yeah, his career is on the upswing. It's it quite, really uh, is. He's got the goods. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool, starting off strong. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. awesome. All right, Dale, thank you for that review. Next up, we have Roadhouse. This is on Prime. Yeah, we're going in the opposite direction on this review. Uh, I saw no good reason to remake the original 1989 film with Patrick Swayze. This new adaptation does nothing interesting with it. And Jake Gyllenhaal brings nothing except a disaffected look and a really ripped body to this <laughs> series. Uh, to this film, excuse me. Uh, thank God it's not a series. It can't even sustain <laughs> the suspense over an hour and a half. The only bright spot in this is the performance of Billy Magnuson as the villain. He is a School of the Arts drama school graduate, and he's quite good in this. But Jake Chillenhall looks like he's barely checked in. He's mostly inter uh, interested in showing off his body. There's almost no dramatic suspense or tension in this film whatsoever. So I was very disappointed in Roadhouse, and I'm only giving you two popcorns, and I'm being generous. Wow. Why wow, Why not one, Dale? Come on. Almost, but not quite. <laughs> he thought about it. He was being generous. Yeah. Wow. Dale letting them have it on a well, Friday. Now we yeah. know what not to watch. Yes, exactly. That's, that is that's really what the segment what is sometimes. Watch. Right. Yeah. It's what to watch and what not to watch. It goes both ways. <laughs> Thanks for that, Dale. All right. And uh, our last one is Lawman uh, Bass Reeves. That's on Hulu. Tell us about that one. Yeah, this is a Taylor Sheridan created series. Of course, he's done Yellowstone in 1891. What really sets this apart is the performance by the actor David Oyuelo. And he is just terrific in this. He becomes a U.S. Marshal. We're in the period right after the Civil War, Reconstruction. His character reminded me a little bit of the famous Clint Eastwood character, the man with no name. He has a name in this series, obviously. It's Bass Reeves. But his attitude is very similar. He's just on the right side of the law. He could go either way, you get the sense. But he's a riveting actor. And when he's on screen, you cannot take your hands off, your eyes off him. And that's the mark of real talent when it shows through an eight episode series and he never drops the character for a moment. So if you're into Westerns, you're into post-Civil War dramas, this is very, very good. But what really makes it special is the performance of David Oyuolo. And he's, I think, one of the best actors working today. And he shows us why in this series. Sorry Four to interrupt. Did you say it is on Hulu, Dale? It's on Hulu. Our graphic said Paramount Plus. Hulu. Right, I was thinking Prime about video. Okay. Just want to make sure that we get that clear. So no, four... you know, I think you're right. I think it is Paramount. 
No, it's Hulu. Pretty sure it's Hulu. Okay. It's definitely streaming out there, so we know that. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Go search for it. There's yeah. too many options I know. to stream. I know. That's but what so, it is. four popcorns, Dale, four popcorns. for that one? Four popcorns good because deal. of the great acting. Great acting. I love that. Okay. Another good one to watch. Yeah. Steer clear from that second one. The <laughs> second one, yes. Uh, he, Don't he, waste he. your time, right? <laughs> <laughs> Don't waste yes, your time. Skip the roadhouse. Drive on by. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. He's waiting for a moment to say that. That was yeah. great. That was a good deal. <laughs> well, we want to thank you again, Dale. Hope you have a great Friday. Uh, we want to share that list with you just one more time. You can watch The Gentleman on Netflix. It has four popcorns. Roadhouse is on Prime. It only has two popcorns, and that's being generous. And <laughs> Lawman Bass Reeves is on Hulu or Paramount Plus or wherever you can search and find it, and that has four popcorns. And don't forget, you can check out all of Dale's previous reviews in our WXAI YouTube playlist. It is titled Mo Movies in Review. You can also visit his website, dalempollock.com. That is on your screen there. We also post all of these on triadcw.com, so lots of options.